Hi everybody, welcome back! Detention Center X, the finest correctional facility in the land. <laughs> it's, it's amazing, isn't it? Look at this, we've done it! We've actually made a correctional facility that's somewhat working. Um, I mean, there's a couple of things to fix as usual. I mean, anytime I start a, a new session of recording or a new batch of recording, um, I've always gone through all of your comments and stuff on Reddit and in the comment section and tips and hints and stuff like that. Um, so let's fix some stuff. And then uh, let's build some new stuff, probably. I really wanted to build an execution chamber, but apparently they're, they're not working. They, they, they don't work yet. Uh, they're only there for looks. You can't actually send anyone to be executed. I had a couple of people in mind for execution, a couple of people lined up, such as Jimmy Steers and Jordan Knight, but they've both been released. Uh, we don't really have any medium security prisoners that we've really earmarked uh, for any, any good reason, other than this guy here. Look at... None other than Cal Speedster Zone. Speedster. Cal Speedster Zone. Cal Zone. Uh, he's got eight years uh, for aggravated vehicle theft and 18 years for armed robbery. He is one bad motherfucker and he's in the right place. He's in medium security. I mean, we could upgrade him to be in with the big boys, but Cal Zone has so far not actually crossed my path in any meaningful way uh, and therefore doesn't need to be punished. Um, all right, let's fix these guards. Let's fix these armed guards. Apparently, they don't need to be walking around in the cell blocks. Apparently, it's better to have dog patrols inside the cell blocks so they can sniff out tunnels and drugs and filthy butts. Uh, if anybody needs a shower, uh, the dog will be the first person to know about it. I mean, of course, the dog isn't a person. It's a dog. Uh, but at Detention Center X, we treat our canines just like we would treat any other member of staff. And therefore, I vote we put a TV inside the kennel <laughs> so that the dogs can want... No, never mind. We're not going to do any of that. Look at these guys. Look at these hardened criminals having their dinner, uh, which consists of bacon. Although, it looks like maybe they've got some other scraps on there. Maybe some egg, some greens. And uh, it looks like maybe just uh, another little tray filled with ketchup uh, to put onto their greens and their eggs, which is... Quite a nice touch, actually. Uh, a, a very nice touch. Okay, uh, so like I said, let's fix these arm patrols. We're going to get rid of this whole arm patrol. There we go. Arm patrol at ease. Uh, we're going to get you out of here, and we're also going to get this arm patrol out of here. We don't need an arm patrol walking around in here. Uh, I think what we'll do is we'll have an arm patrol walking up and down here instead. We're going to have an arm patrol walking up and down here so we're gonna get rid of this dog patrol one dog get out of here arm patrol in this sort of no man's land i think this will be nice there arm patrol of course there's no little icon so you should only click it once uh, unless you want both of your armed guards uh walking up and down the same patrol route which to me probably not the best now where's another place that we could put uh, an armed patrol an armed an armed guard on patrol uh, I was thinking maybe like somewhere along here, but it doesn't look like there's going to be anybody coming down here. Uh, we're going to have to fix access to no man's land for a minimum security in a minute as well. Um, possibly here where this other dog patrol is. That might be nice actually. Visitors coming to Detention Center X can be met with a man um, who has a flak jacket on and uh, ammo hanging off of his flap jacket and is holding a shotgun and just sort of rustles them into... Uh, the visitation center by going woo, 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 woo. you know like when you're when you're really trying to rush uh, rustle somebody into a room or whatever that might give them the thrill of their life um, and that's what we want when people visit detention center X we want to make sure that they have had the thrill of their young life and, uh, and that's what we aim to do uh, so dog patrols then we're gonna have a dog patrol that goes sort of up and around through here it's gonna visit all the cells there you go one dog patrol and let's also have a dog patrol in medium security somewhere uh, we're gonna have uh, a dog who patrols around in medium security sniffing out some cells uh, we're gonna g get another dog on the case as well say so you can get out of here then uh, guard guy and we're gonna replace you with we're gonna upgrade this patrol route with a dog there we go another dog patrol Okay, great. Let's buy another dog then. <laughs> we're gonna buy. We're gonna buy another dog for Detention Center X, 
uh, as, as soon as we can find the actual... I think if you hover over the room, it gives you like... It sort of highlights. There we go. See, look, it's easier to find. Okay, uh, let's get another dog crate in here then. And with all of the money that we have, let us hire another dog handler. There you go. Oh, look, that dog just stole Scruffy's bed. I don't think, I think when Scruffy comes back and finds out that his bed has been stolen, he's going to be pretty pissed. Uh, but we're going to have to let that one play out. It's just going to be like an episode of um, your favorite um, TV drama. Uh, when that happens, but it'll be dogs. Uh, okay, we're gonna get rid of this guard who's on patrol here, and we're gonna get our new dog patrol uh, to patrol around here. And he's gonna actually come all the way down here uh, into the shower area as well, and make sure he gives the prisoners a good old sniff and make sure that they've been washing themselves adequately. Great! All right, we'll be able to sniff tunnels, apparently. We'll be able to sniff out some drugs. If Calzone has decided to come back uh, into his cell with some drugs, we'll know about it, uh, which is also a good thing. It looks like somebody has been searched inside the wall and is preventing this door from closing. Um, he seems to be stuck. He's got... He really needs to go to the bathroom, and this guard seems to be preventing him from doing that. Can we... Can we take him to the bathroom? Let's take him into the bathroom here. Let's take him into there. Did somebody come and pick this guy up? It's Sarah Brightman's brother. Uh, she's not going to be too happy to find out that he has been locked inside a wall and desperately needs to go to the bathroom. Oh, here he goes. Okay. Sarah Brightman's brother is being taken to the holding cell for a bathroom break. Uh, she'll be pleased to know. Uh, if any of you are friends with Sarah Brightman, please let her know that her brother is in capable hands. Look at that. Uh, he's stuck again. Why the fuck am getting stuck all the time? There he goes. Oh, look. He really needs to go to the bathroom. There's a bathroom right there. Okay, I think he's going back to his cell. I think he wants to go back to his cell to use his own toilet. I I get where he's coming from. I don't know if you're anything like me uh, when you went to school or indeed when you go to work. Um, are you the type of person who prefers to go to the bathroom in their own bathroom or do you not mind using public bathrooms? I, for one, prefer my own. Uh, and I actually used to skip school to go home and use my own bathroom. True story. Uh, I'm not um, I'm not proud of it, but it's just something that had to be done at the time. And uh, I'm sure that some of you out there are the same. Look at this. Oh my god. What a shower area. Look at these guys go. Holy shit. Calzone is showering with his clothes on because he's that much of a badass. Okay, uh, we need to sort out some access uh, for this area too. Um, See, look, there's no access for minimum security to get into this area here. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to build a door uh, here uh, at the end of the cell block so that they can get into this no man's land and get up into uh, into this area. And it looks like we found some drugs. We found some drugs on somebody. Uh, it's this guy, Stephen, what's his name? Venning. Stephen Venning. He's sentenced to five years for assaulting an officer. Uh, and he's just been caught with drugs as well. Holy shit. We're going to start finding a lot of drugs, I think, because of these dogs. Look, see, the dogs are having a good old sniff. Look, they're in Steven Venning's cell right now, searching out to see if there's any... Oh, look, there's, like, some little sniffing icons coming up when the dog goes by. Look at that. He's doing, like, some sort of, like, moonwalk move every time he goes by somebody. Look at this, Harris. There's no running from the dogs. Well, he just did actually run away from the dogs. Um, and probably got away with it. There you go. Oh, look. I guess that's the only thing, though, with this patrol is that occasionally the dog will need to go back and have a rest. Look, he look he's just dragging the dog all over town. Poor Scruffy. He's going to be really pissed when he finds out that old Muffins here has stolen his bed. Look, he's going in for his, his daily nap. He's tired. The dog is tired. He's been sniffing up a storm and is too tired to even notice that uh, Muffins has stole his bed. So he's just stolen uh, Ruffy's bed instead. Fucking, we have the best dogs in this uh, detention center. It's fucking crazy. All right, uh, so let's um, let's do this then. We are going to demolish a wall. Uh, we're going to demolish two walls, actually. We're going to demolish these two walls. We're also going to demolish these two walls. Uh, and we're going to put a new jail door uh, here. We don't want anyone going past this point. Uh, however, uh, we don't want them to get stuck here either. So we're going to dismantle this door. If it lets me. Yes. Okay. It has let me. Uh, the walls are coming down. There we go. And hopefully the new door will go in just in time for the prisoners to not make an escape. Come on. Just move this door over here. What are you doing? You can do it. Oh, okay. No. Somebody's going to bring in a new door. And if we can move this door as well, that would be great. 
Also, let us put some paving stones down here. That's nice. And uh, we will also, before anyone gets into no man's land out here, uh, we want to make sure that uh, we do a metal detection on them as well. Very important. Uh, we don't want anyone leaving the cell block, especially minimum security, with uh, some sort of shank or maybe a knife or uh, like a bayonet or something. Something. These people manage to get their hands on all types of outlandish shit. I don't know how it happens or why, but there you go. It does happen and you have to be very careful. Otherwise, shit hits the fan in a major way. Although in saying that, right now, danger level is very low. Four prisoners uh, of out of the, wow, 55 that are currently serving time in the slammer say uh, they are well treated and three have serious complaints. I guess all the other ones are just completely, well, looks like a lot of them are suppressed uh, and some of them have been deterred. Uh, for bad behavior somehow. Not quite sure how that's worked out. But there you go. All right, let's uh, hook up some power to here too. How are we doing for power? Uh, we're okay for this uh, section of the prison. And it looks like maximum security. Things have not gotten out of hand. These guys actually have windows. Uh, they're very close to the edge of the map. A lot of people were a bit concerned about that, saying that these guys will have no problem escaping or whatever. Uh, we'll have to see. Hopefully that's not the case. God, these dog patrols. We might need to double up on the dog patrols. Because, look, the dogs have to go back and rest. And then we lose the fog of war. I might just hire in some more dogs and uh, more uh, canine handler guys uh, so that we can do that. Okay, great. Uh, where is the office? The office is here. We got the chief. Uh, I think uh, we could probably make uh, use of this space here. We have this enormous staff room, which I don't even think is actually needed. Uh, it would be kind of cool if this staff room was maybe turned into the security office because it's kind of big. Uh, it might be an idea. Maybe we can do that. Maybe we can just have this like small staff room. We're going to downgrade the staff room. We're going to downgrade the staff room and just put it in here. It's just like this little crappy room that people go in and just like drink a Diet Coke or whatever and contemplate the things that have happened. Hey, what's going on? You are in the wrong area. Excuse me. How did you even... Oh, I see. Okay. We need to set this to Minsec. It's because we opened it up to the no man's land here. Uh, okay, so Minsec only. And we want to make sure that this is all max uh, sec. Uh, this is uh, shared, shared, shared. Okay, so now all the Minsec guys can actually make it to class. They can go and learn some stuff and this other classroom too. These guys can all, all make it to these shared facilities here as well. And the medium security guys can also make it to the shared facilities. Perfecto. I think we've done it. I think we've sorted out the routing problem that we had with prisoners. And then, of course, um, there's this way into MinSec as well, which we're going to probably close off. We're going to probably close off access to this yard uh, from here because we want this to be the entrance to all of the um, all of the cell blocks, this, this main entrance here. Uh, and because it's the main entrance, we're going to shove a uh, metal detector in front of it as well. There we go. Even better. Fucking holy shit, that's going to be amazing. Okay, uh, let us also then uh, put a brick wall uh, here. We're going to we're gonna set up a brick wall right here. We're going to close off this access, uh, and which means that we can probably... Hey! Okay, he's been released. <laughs> oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. I thought he was just chancing it and trying to escape, but no, he's actually been released. Uh, what is this? What's this little dog symbol here? Does it mean that he's done, like, it marked his territory there or something? Look at this. This tired guard is patrolling. He's just going to be like, huh? Who did that on the ground? He's going to think that it was one of his co-workers when, in fact, no. Well, it was. I mean, technically, it was a co-worker. But uh, at the same time, not really. Guys, what are you doing? You can't come through this way. Look, there's a wall in the way now. We're trying to actually get rid of this. Guys? Oh, wait. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> I see. All right, we're going to dismantle this jail door then before it causes any more problems. Uh, so now... Uh, access into this whole area is uh, through here, which is kind of awkward actually. you got to walk through an entire cell block and have these guys sort of spitting and urinating all over you as you make your way through into here. Uh, but the visitation center is accessible uh, from out here and we're probably going to move the visitation center actually uh, so that it's not just for minimum security. It'll be a shared uh, thing as well. Maybe up here. Might be able to put it up here. We can make uh, families do like this long walk of shame through no man's land uh, and of course have um, all the medium security prisoners um, spit on them and urinate on them uh, from within the confines of the yard. Uh, that reminds me actually. 
probably need some weight benches out here too. Do we need some weight benches for minimum security? I think so. I think minimum security as much as maximum and minimum security enjoy exercising out in the yard. So we will buy some weight benches for them. Uh, let's just make sure that... Oh, look at this. This yard... This whole... Why does this keep happening? Is it because of this? Is it because I put the wall there? Okay, this should now just be minimum security. We'll see though. It might change again uh, in a second, but we'll have to see.